Welcome to another week in the House of Hamlet. What will the drama king of Denmark get himself into this week? <laughs> Let's find out. Meet the cast of House of Hamlet. Polonius! Hello? Where's the camera? Here? Hello? I'm just gonna... I'm Polonius. Uh, but you can call me Mr. Prankster! <laughs> so... Hamlet's my pal, but I think he's too concerned with women. Oh, Adophilia is just way too traditional and boring for Hamlet. Oh, shit. Ophelia! Why, hello there to my honeys. I'm Ophelia, and I'm Hamlet's girl, so before you basics even go thinking you have a chance with him, remember this, babes. He's mine. But I'm so over Hamlet's back and forth drama and all of his confusing signals. I'm my own woman. So, I've recently become Wicca as part of I'm That Witch Enterprises, trademark pending, and this witch won't take it anymore, bitch. And if you're interested in becoming part of the big No tribe, thanks, Claudius. The name's Claudius. Claude for short, if we're friends. But we're not! I run this show. What does life mean to me? Life means three things. Getting laid. Getting paid. <laughs> but most importantly, <laughs> taking over the world. <laughs> Girl, prude. That's Queen Gertie to you peasants. <laughs> My husband may think he's the one in charge around here, but he's a few jewels short of a pearl necklace, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Always trying to steal my spotlight. <laughs> but at least I have my gorgeous, perfect son, Hammy, around to keep me company. And he just adores his Fabulous mommy. Nobody has my joie de vivre. Uh, that's French, in case you didn't know. <laughs> and of course, it's always nice to be around someone who isn't constantly trying to screw me. I'm not a woman who enjoys being screwed. And of course, Hamlet. Greetings, normies. Yes, it's me, the tragic royal son. What are my hobbies? Oh, I don't know. Reading the so-called classics. Having lively debates with myself in the mirror since no one else can match my intelligence. Staring longly out the window while my servants draw me a bath. Whatever. Who cares? This show is all a bunch of bullshit to satisfy my whore mother and that spotlight called Claudius. Think he'll jump off a bridge for all I care. No one understands me. And this is my show. Hamlet, you hoes. This is House of Hamlet. Last week on House of Hamlet. I've had it up to here with you, and I'm going to need a bigger crown. <laughs> and he thinks I'm a virgin. <gasps> Yikes. That can be good. Yeah, I mean, what can I say? Um, today sucks, just like every day. Felt super hungover, a bit of the dog's hair to get me going. No one understands me. No one can completely get what it's like to be me. The pressure, the suffering, it's just, I don't know, what do I do, man? Life, right? Maybe it's all just a simulation. Maybe none of it's real. 
My so-called girlfriend never checks on me. She's too worried about her stupid business. What about my business? What about my business? <laughs> So things have been going really well, except that Hamlet and I are fighting and my family and I are fighting and everyone like disapproves of my life choices and totally hates my literal guts and thinks I should have no control over my life or my choices or my body. <laughs> so really just a normal day. Hamlet may be totally great, but I got him exactly where I want him. So that's why I have the amazing support of other young entrepreneurs like me. We have our Facebook group called the Dreamers and the Schemers. They're so supportive. Unless you say something polarizing and then it's, you're out of there, babe. Not that we scheme per se. Uh, who said scheme? Definitely not me. <laughs> Too small. Get me another one. Go. Words. No pinky. The nerve of that horrid man. Absolutely no decency at all. Did you catch that? Never broke eye contact. <laughs> I win this round, Gertie. Oh, sit here. Like this. Whoa. Ooh. I feel like I'm staring into the eye of the beast. Ah, fuck. 